yesterday and blast Dundee United. I don't know what Jockey Scott's got to do, I really don't. We all went for Dundee to go down because lack of resources, they spent their money in the stadium, they didn't merge with United because of all the troubles. But, you know, they get the penalty, Belio makes a mess of it. But I still can't understand why Jockey Scott has been left dangling like this. A committee, probably one of the great Dundee players, even if some of the fans can have a go at him. This is their eyes. We, we obviously don't see the off the ball incident, Jim, yeah. but Jim McCluskey makes his mind up. It's a red card. He seems quite happy. I mean, he extends his hand there to McCluskey, shake on it. I'll well, go. I wonder if he got it right then, eh? Yeah, yeah. But uh, Very disappointing, though, for Sturrock, isn't it, to see that happen? Well, he. And D United are like Aberdeen in a way. Paul Sturrock is a, a talented young manager, but when you're losing goals the way they have all season, they struggle to score. Wally Faulkner, he's had a great season too, hasn't he? You know, veteran Wally, and he's played up front. Not, not always been his natural position, but uh, the big man scored a few goals, certainly got Dundee out of many a hole this season. But again, Boyack, he's come in, he gets some playing, they're a spirited team. I think they have good good balance in their, their dressing room. Young James Grady, <laughs> he enjoyed we always it, called didn't him, he? I think he's about 29 now. <laughs> but he was asked, I said about four or five weeks ago, both him and Eddie, Eddie Annan hadn't scored enough when they were down the bottom and fighting with that threat of relegation at the time. Me, James Grady, has certainly responded. He's got a few goals. And yet again, 16th goal of the season for Wally Faulkner. Not bad, is it? I think it's a great return. When you're playing at one of the smaller clubs and you don't get as much service as the big guys get, the Vidukas, the Billy Dodds, the Rod Wallaces of the business, when you're only getting short supply and you get 16 goals, that is a wonderful return and a great job Jockey Scott has done. OK, Charlie, so after this weekend, Rangers now have a 22-point lead and they've really won this title by a street. Absolutely out of sight.